Hi, kitty cats. Today I want to make the most important update to my healing after gender affirming surgery. As an introduction, I want to bring up some comments left before I receive the procedures I did. The comments typically expressed hope, or at least hope that I would post honest videos about how poorly the surgery went and how much I regretted every decision I made. Now, I understand why this is. With the overwhelming evidence of satisfaction after gender-affirming care, these commenters need me to confirm their erroneous bias. The comments made three primary claims. First, that this surgery is experimental and would leave me mutilated. Second, that I would regret the process from beginning to end. And third, that I would lose all sensation in the general area and never again experience another climax. Now, when I was still in Thailand, I dispelled the first claim out of hand. Even before I'd healed much at all, I made videos about how ecstatic I am with the way I look, both top surgery and bottom surgery. The second claim was easily dispelled as well. By the time I'd left the hospital, I realized the weight that had come off my shoulders with gender-affirming surgery. So that leaves only the third claim, that I would never again experience climax. And yesterday, yesterday, I got a bit exploratory. It's been almost seven weeks and I was a bit frustrated. And I am pleased to dispel that third and final claim. Everything works and it was fucking amazing. <laughs> I will reiterate what I've said many times. Gender-affirming care saves lives. It's certain to have saved mine. Talk soon. Bye.